Welcome back to WTI. Are you laughing because you're super excited I to try all this delicious I am super excited for this food? episode. I know. This is pretty exciting. This is what happens when we let Missy decide. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so there is a store in Hudson called Specialty Meats and Gourmet, and it's actually been here for in its current location for the last four years. It's been around since 1999. Um this is fantastic. It's not just your ordinary meat store. So if you're expecting to go in and get some steaks cut up, wrong place to be. Right? That's what you said. Oh, that's right. You haven't been there. I haven't been in there. You got to go there. I will. You can go next time and pick up what we're going to eat for I lunch. will do that. Okay, perfect. So it was really hard to decide what to get because they have all kinds of exotic and specialty meats. Okay? So... After looking at it all and <laughs> trying to decide, you know. How brave were you today? I'm pretty brave. Yeah. I was trying to decide if you would go along with this. And I okay. wanted it so that we would both try it. So what I got was your favorite thing. Yeah. Snake. I'm not sure about that one. It's not just any snake either. It's python. Python spring rolls. So we deep fried them. We're going to try them and let you know what we think. We also have kangaroo meat. We decided to make those into meatballs. We actually took a little, um, we crushed up croutons because we didn't have any breadcrumbs. We're improvisers. Right. We're like chefs. Yep. Okay. And then we cut up some onions and an egg and made meatballs. So we'll try that. We have duck, bacon, and jalapeno sausages. So they kind of look like brats. Mm -hmm. We have... Goat salami. I didn't know what it was going to look like. It was packaged when she bought it. Right. I didn't know what it was going to look like, and I didn't get directions. And what I mean by directions is, do it's you take that fully cooked, right? Casing up? or? Well, we'll find out. Okay. I have to say something, and I am open to anything, but the smell of it was a little off. Right. Okay. Okay. So we've got that. Oh, in the big one. So we're going to save this, this to last because this might, we might go out on a bad note here. I'm not sure what's going to happen. But I got talked into, they have all kinds of salsas, all different kinds. So if you like hot, they have, you know, different levels mm -hmm. of hotness. But I was told that this is one of the hottest peppers out there. And it's a Trinidad Maruga Scorpion Salsa. And it says weapons grade on it. <gasps> we're not quite sure what that means. I'm kind of a, I like, I like spicy but spicy to a certain extent. Right. I'm concerned about this with your hot flashes. What's going to happen? Well, that So this is actually made at St. Croix Farms. So, wow, this is going to be exciting. We actually had to put the lid back on it. Because it's a little strong it smelling. Was, yeah, burning our eyes a little bit. Okay. Let's try this. Okay. Just so you know, after we're done with this and uh, we put it up, we're also going to post a story about um, specialty meats and gourmet. It really is fantastic, so you should check it out. They're also on Facebook, too. So okay. What, do, what should we start with? I say let's start with the kangaroo. The kangaroo? Okay. okay. Hey, we have three different sauces here, too. We have barbecue, mustard, and sweet and sour. Okay. So I say I'm going to try it with sweet and sour. Okay. I'm going to do the barbecue. Okay. Tastes to me like... I like it. Like a venison meatball. Sweeter. Yeah. Uh-huh. But, um... I would definitely eat that again. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think my husband would really like it. And there's no fat in this. Mm-mm. At all. I mean, there wasn't a lick of fat when we cooked it. Yeah. So, what would you spray the bottom of the pan? Yeah, or cook something. I know when I cook game meat, I usually cook a piece of bacon first mm -hmm. just to get a little bit of the grease, the fat mm -hmm. on the pan. Otherwise, that's a good, it sticks. That's a good idea. Okay. Okay, next, let's the try duck bacon jalapeno sausage. Okay. Are we trying this without dipping first? No. Well, no. you can. I'm going to dip mine in a little mustard. Okay. I'll just do I a, like mustard. I'll do a titch of mustard. A titch. A titch. Who says that? What do you, <laughs> I guess I do. 80? <laughs> No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Yeah. And I do know that it's duck is not one of my favorite game meats. 
And this is good. I don't know if I've had duck. I would assume at some point in my life I have, I've had duck nachos that were okay. incredible. But this, it's good. Yeah, it is very good. Oh, and it's not too hot. I just kind of now started tasting no, the jalapeno. I think it's got the perfect amount of spices in it. Wow, that's good. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so now Missy's gonna try the... <laughs> no, we're trying it together <laughs> and I'm gonna watch you try You're it. Because sometimes me? she tries to fake me out. So this is python spring roll. Python. Python. And we're not gonna be python zapped or anything by it. I have a fear of snakes. So this is way out of my comfort range. I'm a tiny bit nervous and I don't know why. Okay. Okay. It's fantastic. You can't tell me that's not good. No, I can't. It's just fine. Oh, I'm glad. I thought yeah. you were gonna go, yes I can. <laughs> <laughs> Watch me. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, it tastes like a spring the roll. The veggies are in there are really good. Yep. It's carrots, um, cabbage. It's I good. It's just, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Uh, okay. And all the goat cheese. The goat it's cheese. goat salami. Goat salami. So. I'm acting funny about this because it really does have a strong scent. And maybe I don't know anything about goat cheese, and maybe goat cheese smells. Adam, does it smell? Oh. Adam, our DP, shake... Shaking his head, yes, it's very strong, Shirley. We're gonna get rid of, do you take this outer layer off? Talk to me. Cause if you don't and we, if you're supposed to and we eat it, I feel like we, can you peel it? Oh, you can. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, cause most, yeah. Oh, the powder is just okay. flying. Go okay, ahead. there's my piece. Okay. Now it's your, <laughs> cut your piece. I. I'm sorry, it, the, the smell is a little much. That's why I put it on your side. Okay, ready? Oh. One, two, three. Mm, it's not my favorite. And I think I'm gonna have a chip or a drink water here. <laughs> this one is hard to get down. Maybe the Trinidad will burn it right out of our mouth. Right, the salsa is gonna. Oh no! Well, take the flavor away. Yeah, I'm sorry, Linda. I didn't love that one. So far, everything. Yeah, should we eat a little scorpion? Or I mean, python? Yeah, I'm gonna get a little sweet and sour sauce in my mouth. This really is good. Mm -hmm. And maybe it's a deep fried, but it's good. Mm -hmm. That better got a little unique flavor in it. Maybe my first bite, I didn't get as much scorpion or python, whatever I'm eating. Uh-oh. All right, okay. folks. Let's talk about this before we start this, because we might have to abruptly end this video. If we do, thanks for watching. Yeah, it's been great. <laughs> okay, so hey, um, like I said, Specialty Meats and Gourmet in Hudson. Check them out on Facebook. They have a website. We'll actually put the link on this video um, and we'll do a write-up on it. Um, I took all kinds of pictures when I was there today and I really could have spent, I could have spent a long, long time yeah. there. It's very interesting and interesting the story behind it all. Um, and where they get their products from locally and yeah, all the over. restaurants they work with. Yep, yep, they sell the restaurants. You can actually buy online all of their products, mm -hmm. which is great, but you gotta stop in. I really, I mean, I recommend just stopping in and spending some time there, and if you love cheeses, it's the place to be. Oh, cheese. They have cheese? Oh, you like cheese, don't you? I do. I like cheese well, more than goat sausage, I think. I'm sorry, I feel bad. I mean, yeah. you can't like everything, I right? I can tell you feel bad. Well, okay, all so, right. let's, so let's, Talk about this one more time here. So, weapons, weapons grade. grade. <laughs> this is scary. Okay. Is this enough? Are you satisfied? I think it is. Boy, that cheese stings. Okay. <laughs> one. <laughs> we don't trust each other ever. One time she <laughs> fooled me and I did something without her. Two. Yep. Three. It's hot. Oh 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Nej. Okay. Okay. It's hot. <laughs> I wonder how, how, how long it's is it gonna be? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. I can't eat the bread right now. <laughs> it helps. <laughs> it's still hot though. I feel like my tongue is completely swollen. My lips are fried. They could be blistering. I think blistering. <laughs> They're not blistering. <laughs> Woo! My dry's are watering. Are you having a hot flash? I'm not that old. Okay, so. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Linda. Um, Thank you for all your help today. This was a lot of fun, and we can't wait to try more stuff. Yeah. Hey, Jenny, if you're watching this, I want you to come over tonight and try this salsa. It's delicious. All right. Keep watching. Check back in a few days, and we'll have another video.